image of mighty stones, having withstood the test of time, jetting up against the otherwise mostly flat horizon in the English countryside in Wiltshire, England. Each day, visitors will pile onto a bus and take a journey from London into the countryside to see Stonehenge. And there was a time in the not-so-distant past where visitors could actually chip off parts of the rocks as personal souvenirs, but no longer. Now, unless special permission is granted, visitors to Stonehenge stay on the beaten trail that leads all around the imposing prehistoric structure, and photo opportunities abound. From different angles, the structure itself seems to morph and change from perspective too. It is like Stonehenge itself is not a static structure made from stone, but rather a dynamic force. A force that inspires and mystifies many a visitor. For throughout the years, many theories have emerged about who likely built Stonehenge. Everyone from the Romans to the first inhabitants of the island of Britain have been named as likely building this structure. And the reason for the structure is just as elusive. Throughout the years, many theories have emerged. Possibly a place of human sacrifice. People who believe in that theory point to the stone slab situated near the center of the structure. Another theory surfaced that the place was to honor and remember departed loved ones. The hills and slopes surrounding Stonehenge often reveal hundreds of buried men and women, their names lost to time. The oldest human remains date back to 3000 BC, according to studies. And the theories about who built Stonehenge, and for what reason, will continue inspiring future discussion. But the origin of the stones comprising Stonehenge are not debated. For the stones themselves were taken first by land, and then by boat, down the English coast from Wales. The actual transportation would have taken many people to organize and their accomplishment certainly paid off, for Stonehenge has stood the test of time. And Stonehenge is also one of the top tourist destinations today. Many notable people, including former President Barack Obama from the United States, have made the trip out to see Stonehenge. And daily, many people also float in and out by bus and by car to see Stonehenge. In addition to seeing the impressive historic site, there is also a gift shop for visitors. Once inside the gift shop, visitors will find truly unique treasures for purchase, many of which are not easily found anywhere else. Stonehenge, a truly unique place, and one of the top tourist destinations in England, rolled up into one impressive spot.